Hello, welcome to this episode in the WellTravel.com beer garden. I'm your host, Ham Tanner, and to my right is the older than he really looks, Ed Hall. 65. Thank you. <laughs> and on this side, in the day glow, lime green shirt, is the new guy. He's colorblind as yellow. Ladies! <laughs> <laughs> and tonight, and behind the camera, is our superstar on the wheels of steel, the lovely, talented Sarah. And the, the other star of the show besides Sarah is the Terrapin Hop Karma Brown India Pale Ale from Terrapin Brewing Company in Athens, Georgia, a place that is near and dear to my heart. Yes, heard of it. To tell us about the Hop Karma beer is the new guy. Let's hope he can keep this shit straight. Nail it or you are gone. All right. BeerAdvocate.com. <clears throat> Douchers. B+. Only 316 reviews, which is kind of not representative. surprising because not Terrapin's representative. a pretty medium company. Medium, medium. Generic uh, bottle cap. Not a good sign. Good company. Gold, like a gold domer, like Notre Dame helmets. Get rid of that shit. No gold domers on our beer. Yes. Thank you. Next. Uh, they received That's the palette. The bros gave it a minus. Yeah. So they Pretty received. Good. So they got a palette. So they got a palette. Uh, let's see. Six uh, percent alcohol by volume. Not, Not enough. That's yeah, pretty, it's okay that's for this mediocre. style. Your beer. phone just jumped off. Really? Nambla. Should I get it? Might be important. Nambla again. Could be Nambla. Could be some. <laughs> you're the. Hey, you're the treasure. This <laughs> beer was. Uh, Could be a new loss. Formerly known as <laughs> Lost, India dude. style brown ale. India style. That was the just straight name. Who 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 named it that? I Terrapin did that. No. What do they call it now? Indian. They call it the Terrapin Hop Karma IPA. I don't but like the made it's up just names. The India style brown ale. May I say that on the label on the bottle with this turtle playing what looks like a that's Cora, a, that's a, which is a um, that's a sitar dipshit. A, big a sitar. That's a sitar. Okay, well it looks a little bit like a Cora, which is a uh, Mali instrument. Well, anyway, well that's interesting, but it, that's a sitar. It is interesting, but anyway, it says Hop Karma Brown IPA, Holy Brown man. India Pale Ale. I don't know. I mean, you know, yeah. you can change the facts, but the facts are on the label, bro. They are. I don't know why they, whatever. Why do, you just, have, why do you have that all highlighted and whatnot? I need you to bring this up. Why do you use pink? Because uh, my other highlighter is dried out. You, you, hey, you know, you have enough I don't have good do. office supplies at work. Staples, He's got enough work Staples to do. Staples carries green, yellow. You don't use pink. We're paying this guy to like do beer pink. reviews and highlight shit. Like it's been pink. two and a half hours pulling up what took me five all seconds. Right. Hey, my tip of the cap. Yeah, goes to you better yeah. move on. All yeah. right, um, better be a good one. Tip of the cap goes to one of my best friends, Brandon Lee. He's a follower of ours. Shit! On, uh, Holy crap! That's Bruce Lee's that's son. Bruce Lee's son. I know. Died in a crow. He came back. He yeah. came back. Dude, I have I had no idea your friends. Is with he still Brandon kicking Lee. ass? He's kicking ass. You are friends with the crow. He's I have no respect for you. In uh, West Hartford, PD. West Hartford PD. He's, West, he's, West Hartford really PD. Alive. Yes. I bet he's so he's like police Elvis. brutality he's like Elvis. all over the place, really right? Right, right. Police brutality, kicking everybody's ass. Yeah. yeah. Brandon Lee. Damn. Wow. Good That's stuff. a bombshell. Good stuff. Okay, you go ahead. I'm ready. This is the hardest part of the show. It is not hard. <laughs> I've gotten real nervous about it. You guys have the weakest palates to be able to. <laughs> got real nervous Go about ahead. it. Um, let's start drinking this. Wait. I'm done talking about Before it. Before we do, I have a special guest for our program tonight. Oh, it's his hand puppet. <laughs> no, our special guest for the show tonight. Oh, what the? Boy, you're, boy, you're really pulling on the heart Heartstrings. Here. Don't break that shit. I won't. That's my damn dog. Yeah, I, I, had, I handled that. Like it was a Fabergé egg, even though it was more important than any Fabergé egg that ever Why are you existed. stealing my dog out of my office? Ladies and gentlemen, in this egg are the remains of Bella, Ed's Nova Scotia duck tolling retriever, who when we started this company in 1998... I'm going to have to leave the set. I know he's tearing up. I am too. Pulling on the heartstrings. 
Bella, viewership's going up. Bella came to work with Ed every day from 1998 until 19, uh, 2009? Yeah, probably. Yeah. Mid, like late? Yeah. At least 10 years. At least 10 years. 10 plus years. Bella came to the offices of Well Traveled Living to work. Her job was to bark at all UPS and FedEx delivery trucks. Just to clear up, she didn't come to work in that egg. No, no, she came to work in her... In her body. Her Nova Scotia duck trolling body. But she's like a real in a body, not But she act. was a family member of yeah. not just Ed's family, but the well-traveled family. Everybody loved her. She was a sweetheart. Yeah. Even when she got old and puked on the carpet a lot. Mm-hmm. She did. She did. Not but, any more than you, but, but she did. You know, <laughs> everybody would clean it up. Everybody but Ed. <laughs> <laughs> My dog. Bella, rest in peace. You are always going to be our most favored employee of the month. That will never change. Well, that's very nice, but thanks for the giant buzz kill. Let's move on. That's why you need to drink that beer, son. Oh, we're like hot dog. <laughs> we're like a hot dog. <laughs> All right. Do we sniff and smell and taste? We sniff and smell. I'm just All right. freaking me out. All right. This thing's a root beer color. Does not smell like root beer. Holy shit, like Santa Claus shit. <laughs> I don't generally drink beer with a dead dog on the table. There's not a dead dog. It's the remains of a lovely dog. The We got a dog now, but Memorial she doesn't do anything but eat hot dogs. You don't love her like you loved Bella. No, she's a stray. Wilbur. Ed loved Bella <laughs> like you can only love your wife and your first dog. That's right. And that's the truth. She's a good one. Yeah. She was a good dog. Yeah. Tollers are good. She, she, when you're, uh, she I'll dog. tell you what, if you need a dog that will get after the frickin' squirrels. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You and see, she loved Chinese food. <laughs> Didn't she? <laughs> see, that dog would eat anything. Jigong? She'd go up to Jigong oh, and sit yeah. there and stare at him? He'd give her stuff, though. Yeah. That's why she went to him. She'd stare at her if you were giving her chicken wings. Oh, yeah. Anything. Yeah. Remember that dog that died, that pit bull that died in Ch- uh, Mexico on the chicken wings? Choking yeah, on the chicken yeah. wings? No, that was me and William. You weren't there. That dog drank, drank some paint. <laughs> what? Yeah, not yeah. good. Was it Bobo? What was that dog? Anyway. Not good. not good. We talk about dead dogs a lot. Sorry. Mm. What do you got over there? My grade? Yeah. It's awesome. I like it.